What's up guys, thanks for joining me for another unboxing and review. This is the Amazon Fire TV Stick and um, I picked this up for $19, $19.99 for uh, Amazon Prime members when they first released it. Uh, right now it retails for $39.99 and um, it is back ordered for December, I mean uh, January, it's December right now and uh, if you order one now you won't get it shipped till January. Um, but it was very cheap at the time uh, for Prime members, it was 50% off and so um, I just bought it as impulse buy and I'm going to do an unboxing setup and a review for you guys. So this is the Fire TV Stick. Um, it's uh, Amazon does have a Fire TV and that's uh, the different device from this. This is the dual core, um, I think the Fire TV regular one has a quad core if that really makes any big difference for um, streaming. Anyways, that's the packaging. Nice feel. Um, so here we go, peel it up. There we have just a black box. Wow, that's a bright orange color. Um, this is the fire, the fire TV stick. It's just a um, HDMI stick. You plug it in. It's very similar to the Chromecast in terms of uh, usability. You plug this into the device, and you have a little power input there. You take that and you plug in, um, plug in a wire from your USB port on your TV to this device. Next we have the controller. Um, this controller does not have the voice uh, enabled feature. I think you can use, you can upgrade your remote though, you can buy a different one. That's the remote there. That's a comparison for them from the Apple TV. About the same size. It's a little shorter, but it's a little wider. It's a comparison with the uh, Apple TV remote. We have here a manual or instruction booklet. Uh, so it just tells you how to set it up, I guess. And inside we have the cable, the USB cable. Seems to be a micro or mini USB sorry or micro I think it's micro um, USB cable there HDMI one of those bendy pieces in case your TV um, HDMI extender in case your TV has uh, too much things plugged in or is too hard to reach we have a power brick for the, in case your TV doesn't have a USB charger, I guess, or a USB plug. It's got an Amazon logo on there. And finally we have some batteries. And that's it for the case. So, again it was 20 bucks for Prime members. Um, I think it was, I feel like it's definitely worth it. The HDMI adapter and the USB cable and the wall outlet alone, you know, that's already like 10 bucks. So, and then you add, you know, functionality of being able to stream Hulu, um, Amazon Music or Disney, Netflix and all that. Uh, it's a very cheap device for only 20 bucks for Prime members. So I'll, just, I'll uh, put in the batteries and I'll show you guys how to set this device up. Get an Amazon logo. Have our controller here. Wow, Fire TV stick. Okay. So it's looking for my remote. And it's telling us that we should um, connect, keep the power adapter connected. Try to get this glare out of your way. Okay, press play to begin. 
It's going to search for my networks and we are going to connect to my network. All right, we have our network uh, inputted. We're going to hit connect and it's connecting to our Wi Fi network. And I guess it's going to try to look for updates now. All right, it's still downloading the latest software. It's been about 10 minutes now. Oh, there it goes. It's going to try, uh, I guess, applying the update. It gave itself a reboot. There we go. All right, so it's just finished the update. I think we're going to finally be able to use the device now. We just plugged into the device to the TV and this is running on the Google TV and it's telling us to press play on the remote. It's going to search for some networks. So we just plugged in the uh, Fire Stick into our uh, TV and apparently it knows my name already so I will say uh, yes and continue and our fire TV is going to check the network speed hello and welcome to your new Amazon Fire TV stick we thank you and enjoy your new Amazon Fire TV stick alright so we just finished the video showing us how to use the device And that was about three to four minutes. Do not enable parental controls. And here's the device itself. Um, this is the menu. So we have games, apps, videos, TV shows. Uh, I assume that apps is where you can go watch Netflix and stuff. This device is very snappy. That's my first impression everything moves very quick um, let's check out the games so it's a very cool device very snappy I uh, would have to work on a full review there seems to be a lot of features in this device so I would have to work out a full I guess uh, review when I play around with this some more Anyways, very cool device. As always, guys, um, subscribe to my channel, and I will uh, post my updates right there. And again, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.